And I should move my camera, right? Let's talk again. We need to see our ammunition. Okay. Camera is fucked up. Game is fucked up. Oh no, that just give me a error while loading the game. Oh no. I sense fuckery. Sense broken, corrupted game files. But it could have been because I was minimizing to fix the camera, so let's see again. What supply today in stockers? I don't know yet. Last time we kind of finished off without doing anything except for hunting the chameleon. And we didn't find it yet, so I guess there will be more chameleon memes now. But you offered me a tip yesterday, so I gladly take it today. Ah, uh, yeah, and I remember we need to get down from here. But first, let's touch the anomaly again. No, just kidding, boys. We're going down. So, there are only a few places left where it could be, right? Basically this area, maybe the deeper forest. Thinking about it again, no, we were at the deeper forest and there was like a crashed uh, jeep with six people. So basically this area, this area, and this area are left. So let's go west first. Whoop, anomalies, we should better be careful. So, in games where you got guns and uh, durability, I'm always scared to reload. Because I'm not sure in which games this might be the case, but I'm afraid of um, lowering the durability of my guns while reloading. Is this a thing on Stalker? Does anyone know? I have the same in uh, Fallout 3 and New Vegas. I'm not sure if this is a thing. Let's go back first. We got no stamina and I can fix it really quick. We always thought of just shooting. I don't know if it's just shooting. That's why I'm uh, mentioning this topic here. I'm really afraid reloading might be killing my guns in games. And I don't really know if there's any game where this is a game mechanic. But you need to... This is not only SVD ammunition. This is for my PKM. Are you paying attention? Bad King, seriously bamboozled. You can't bamboozle the bamboozler. I'm going to bamboozle you even more. <laughs> yeah. Who would have thunk him? Russians reusing their calibers. Oh boy. I was just slanging a bit, Aldebaran. Okay. I want to take it serious. Uh, but we could get rid of these fucking grenades, right? They're like, oh, I thought they are half a kilo, but no, they are not. This lemon is really important. Uh, we are running low on buckshot, but maybe we can buy more buckshot at the scouts terminal. The memes. Shop. Like a sheep online shop, right? Oh, no buckshot. Bad but Yeah, these bad binoculars suck ass. Oh, boys. Getting rid of them. All these matches. 
We used like three of them in the whole game and one only because I misclicked. Or more like didn't know it already counted once you enter the uh, cooking menu and closed it. Uh, we need to refill. I mean, it's only a bit of um, weight here, but every gram counts, right? Mini repair kit. Do we need a mini repair? Mm. No, no, not yet. Let's put it away for now. Same goes for the weapon set, right? Yeah. They're both still good to go. I mean, I'm rarely using them, right? Potatoes that look like balls. Balls to the walls. Why am I going back inside? I know I can't do shit here. I think I didn't save yesterday. So, doing another save for yesterday. And now we should be good to go again. Maybe buy a better night... Is this a thing? Can I actually buy a night vision here? I mean, I'm not even using my old night vision because it looks like shit. I can't show you because it's still in cotton. Yeah, so we need a new night vision anyway, right? So I guess it's more like other. Fuel medicine gear. Night vision. That's what, like one pack that I, first of all, can afford. Second of all, it just says night vision. It might be the same old shit, so I'm not doing it. Not sure. There must be a better one. I know in all stalker games and probably all mods I know there were always like um, a second generation night vision goggles. I don't think there's a third generation. But second, yeah, that's okay enough for me. And I like the um, blue contrast one because it's just way better. I can't even remember what our scout said where he last saw the artifact. He gave me some common direction to go to, that's not weird anomaly. And I can hear it. Are left and right bamboozled? No. So I'm actually hearing it. It's honking. I think I can go close to it without getting punished. Why are you honking? Stop! Fucking on here. Stop it! Whoa! It ate me. I didn't think it would go on top of the fucking truck here. By the way, yeah, I, I know they added lots of new anomalies, but I was talking of like the special anomalies that you see only once or twice in the game. Like the chicken anomaly. Can't. Chicken blindness? I think it was chicken blindness, okay. There must be something at this fucking truck. Holy shit! Oh, my suit. <laughs> it can take it. Oh. Lots of dead people down here. Whoa, ghost! No! <laughs> That's awesome! Whoa! I'm spooked! I think the one in the current um, directory should be the walking file, uh, so better don't change it right now. You can make a copy of it, Mo. Ha! <laughs> 
I'm so spooked right now. Okay. They're just chilling there. I'm not afraid of ghosts. I just love how they look at you. <laughs> oh boys, this is awesome. Wonder if I can kill them. Probably not. There's nothing, holy shit! Oh yeah, there was something. Arthur's info. Hey Arthur. Artorius! Going to fuck you up. Arthur's info. Black Death is spinning in the field. Someone is playing on the strings of rain. Where are you, my unhappy share? Where's my happiness? Who took you? Fucking millennial. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is after the stream, I don't know if I'm able to do it after the stream today because I still uh, need to go on my home trainer and I don't know how fucked up I will be after this. Um, so I'm either changing it today to take another directory for the working copy to work with or tomorrow noon, like 12 o'clock. But I'll have a look that I do it after stream. Because I wasn't going on a home trainer today anyways. I'm kind of in the mood for it, but I feel like I should give my legs a day of rest. Which may sound weird, but I read a bit about it and they are all recommending, yeah, you shouldn't uh, work out the whole week. And that's what I basically did the last few weeks, except for days where I was socializing. Maybe in the tunnel. Yeah, you might be right. I didn't check the tunnel once here. Oh no, not again! But I think I'm able to make it out. Let me go! Oh, I didn't know you trained a lot. So, you're pausing for the same reason, or...? Why are you uh, doing it only every second day? Let me go! Oh, boys. Ah, that hurt. I already told you about the muscle incident, right? Why I discovered my muscles. Yeah, that was still a bit weird. It, I, I'm really honest here, it's still weird to me. Okay. Yeah, I read a bit about it, so I figured if basically, holy shit, the whole internet is saying it. You should maybe give your legs some rest. Yeah, I know you're basically not really killing them off, but destroying them so they can regenerate better. I mean, that's probably a very dirty explanation, but it should get to the point, right? So, and my focus is still on losing weight, and I'm like plateauing right now. I lost 15 kilograms already, but I got the feeling... Um... Wait a second, boys, I need to focus. I think that's no agent. Oh, well, these are agent. 
I think it's only one agent, maybe even a bandit. So um, I'm still focusing on losing weight. I lost 50 kilos now and I got the feeling I'm not making any progress right now, like I'm plateauing. But I think this might also be due to uh, increased muscle mass now because I increased my um, routine, my training routine like four or five days ago. And since then I got the feel, oh, lots of blood suckers. Since then I got the feeling my legs are really building up muscle and I'm really stagnating right now on my weight. But I don't know, it might be just a feeling. Yeah, I saw this one. I was scared to touch it. Hey, buddy. Now I get why that thing sent me to this tunnel. Yeah, I can find the chameleon. Give me my uh, tip, Dead King. Where should I search for it? Just give me like a general, not again, direction like south, north, west, east. Oh, it's back. No! And again loading south. Okay, south is just the worst direction it could have been. So, southeast or southwest. Like I said, south is like just the um, exit. But south, southeast is actually the forest again, southwest is actually the um, car junkyard or car graveyard. And I think he was talking about a graveyard of radiation, so I think the car junkyard would make a lot of sense. Спасибо огромное. Oh, this thing is moving. I thought it's just one big kill zone in general. I think it's actually attacking me. Still observing the area. Can't see an artifact. Oh, this is cheating. Let's move on. I wonder if I can kill this anomaly. Let's go here. Oh no, there's another one of these. Oh no, I quick saved in this very area. I think we're safe again. Another quick save. I mean, I can also see it approaching on my radar. <laughs> Tips about these anomalies? I couldn't remember them, to be honest. I think it got a fixed path.
Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Well, the artifact. Yeah, it said a cemetery of radiation. It's not really helping. Yeah, they got a fixed path. And as long as I move slowly, you can see it moving and see its pattern and see if I'm getting close to its pattern. Trick the system, boys. It's not a dick at all. It's just misunderstood. Like when people are grumpy because they didn't have coffee yet. Basically the same. Buddy. Oh. Where go inside? Cash calling hits. Label on the map. Oh, Scorpion. MP. Yeah, Scorpion looks a bit different. Where's my boy? Almost cross its path here. Don't want to do this, right? Let's go this side then. I think this guy may be the first of them. It's actually difficult to reach because I know. He normally is crossing him. But only every once in a while. Or is it? Yeah, it is. It's actually also crossing my helicopter here. So better move fast. Ah, oh, you can't be fast enough on this shit. Sometimes you just need to be stubborn. We need to get this. They are not dicks, it's just an anomaly on a fixed pattern. There's nothing dickish about it. Rifle, an anomaly damaged rifle, yeah, a damaged arc. There's no part of the barrel and the shutter. 
We could give it to the guy uh, to the cordon, right? It's unlikely that these weapons can be repaired on the field, but that's how the source of spare parts is quite suitable. Um, a bag, bag with ammunition to get the co Oh yeah, we so this and like the bag of medicine. You better use them once you got a high luck, I assume. Mm -hmm. Found my tower, boys. Oh, We're crossing each other. Not safe. I think it's also safe here. Or maybe not. And we take another puff. These anomalies are crazy. Yeah, but it's more like playing memory. I really hate this anomaly. I see a teleport on the broken hell. Yeah, I saw it too, boy. Abba. Uh, yeah, Abba. but thanks for uh, telling me now. So this might be a way. Yeah, he actually sat down there to get on the tower. Gunpowder. No! Kidding me? I'm missing ammunition. Yeah, so about artifacts. I got no fucking idea. Had no effect, but I had it equipped. What is chicken guard? Oh, yeah. Do I have it equipped? Do I even have it in my inventory? Yeah. Well, good enough, I guess. I think I also had this equipped earlier. Нет, без музыки тут грустно. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. I mean, I know which path to take, so it's okay. But it's a little bit annoying. Oh, this helicopter. Oh, wrong, wrong, wrong way. Yeah, much safer. The witch tower, boys. This tower, okay. That's... I was going to say one huge crate, but it's not. Chance. 
Chameleon. We got it. Which color? An artifact indicator of the success of its owner. Being in a backpack or in the bosom, it has an ugly grey color, but it's worth it to hang it on the belt and it will immediately turn into one of four shades. If the chameleon turns green, then its owner is likely to smile luck if yellow or special surprises from fate should not wait, as indeed in troubles. And if the artifacts, artifact turns orange, then you should be careful and do not risk in vain. Well, if the chameleon was filled with blood red and black strips appeared on its surface, do not pass the trouble. It's green. So, I guess Молодец. this should be the perfect moment. Да, what do we have here? I can actually choose the ammunition. I don't even know my caliber. One of these three. I think it's this here, but I'm not sure. Oh boys, does anyone know? Fifty one of fifty four, okay. Yeah, we got it. I can't equip it on this thing though. Guess it's only for our useless SVD man. Oh boys, get the fuck down here! Oh wow, what a meme. Oh no, not stepping into this thing again. Oh no, 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 no. Where? Let's move out now. Oh yeah, moving out was this way, right. No, it wasn't. There should be one open, right? Oh, I found it. And I know why. I don't have my anomaly detector equipped. That's why I couldn't find a single anomaly. Oh boys. Details. Fucking details. Yeah, that one anomaly stripped me of my detector. I still have it? Yes. Oh, close one. The fucking cock set again. I don't have any painkillers left. <laughs> we made it! But yeah, this... <gasps> Fucking hate you. Um, so, this anomaly wasn't so bad after all. Not again. It's like every fucking anomaly in this country points me here.
So, we found the chameleon again. But I got the feeling it's going to disappear at some point. Mems. Okay, boys. How long have you been here? Half a year? Well, it's considered a long period for exclusion zone. Why did you come here? Hunt for artifacts, why else? There's an abnormal zone here. The artifacts in it are not the same as on the cordon. The only thing is that the Valden is, is wild here, regularly attacking crowds of some creatures. It happens that for several days they keep me in my kennel. It is good that I have here a supply of provisions and water. What kind of creatures? Where so many of them? I don't know, but it looks unusual. That is, they do not jump out of the next line, no, it happens this way. Somewhere nearby there's a hiss, crackling, a bright star begins to shine, and prisms of the ground climb dozens of wild boars, kings, zombies and other rubbish. It's just some kind of Armageddon, how to drive me here and I sit. Then they troop somewhere disappear. But you know, this is not good. What kind of kings? Kind of zombie, like a peasant, lanky such, but with ugly hand shafts. He doesn't have brains, eating carrion or raw meat, trash shorter. You will see, shoot at once. Why not arrange a shelter elsewhere? It was such an idea, but there's a problem. There are no suitable buildings in the vicinity. In addition, it is within easy reach from here on the anomalous zone. Comfortable spot, but the bad seems to me that such a sudden appearance of crowds of evil in one particular place has some reason. Do you think? Intuition prompts. Did not try to look for regularity in their appearance. Maybe they come at the same time interval. Maybe this is somehow related to your activities in this place, says. Appear any time. In addition to gathering artifacts, I'm not doing anything else except... Wait, actually, I build this hideout on... Uh, and how are they called? Um, it's not Indians, right? They're called different in English. Blinded by the light, Jeff has not. My <laughs> yeah, yeah they appear anytime. In addition, blah blah blah. I'm watching some creatures, and to always be alert, space several motion heat sensors, but. How can this affect? Uh, Even after the trams I watch, I want to study their scheme of motion. Uh, scheme of motion. Trams? Those anomalies that you saw in the northern part of landfill, they look like barely terrestrial tornado with a black cloud at the top. Dangerous that they can sharply change their location by attacking a person. I noticed that they can move strictly in a limited radius around a certain point. If you calculate it, you can understand how to get around this anomaly. Helpful information. Yeah, we already figured out. I would like to know about uh, north of the zone. North? Where exactly do you want to go? To the executor of desires. Yeah, wish granter. Are you serious? Completely. Well, not ask why you need this, since you were able to get here to me, and then you understand what the zone is and what death is. Therefore, there's no reason to dissuade you. I'll tell you everything I've learned during my stay here. First, the Wishmaker is in Pripyat. Do you know where it is? Well, yes, in an abandoned city in the north. Abandoned and stuffed with anomalies, mixed with mutants. Secondly, the road to Pripyat lies through the planned Rostock, army warehouses and radar. The plan is located one kilometer from here. Did you uh, see the gate next to my refugee? This is just the way to Rostock. The only problem is that it is mined. This is third if it's consistent. Who mined it? Military. I heard a story that there were some people in the Rostock uh, in Rostock before the accident. Immediately after the second explosion, the soldiers rushed to save them, but did not have time, plus they themselves also fell. The survivors dribbled from the plan in great panic, mining their way. What they were so afraid of is unknown, so the way to Rostock is blocked. How can you overcome this minefield? I have one idea, the fact that it uh, that mines which were laid by the warriors are of an anti-personal type that is designed to defeat manpower. Apparently the soldiers in this way wanted to stop the herds of mutants chasing after them. In the process of this, uh, his rape, the soldiers threw a broken armor personal carry on the edge of the field, so on it 
was just possible to pass through this field. Armor will protect from splinters. This is how you could get to the plan. The only trouble is that this armored personal carrier is out of order. What do you need to fix it? Honestly, I already digged a little in it. In fact, Rostock is also interested. According to rumors, there is another anomalous zone. In general, he had a reducer, the gears flew. We need a new one. I saw here abandoned BTRs. Can I take the details from them? Hardly, because they all stand for a long time under the open sky and rusted. If you can get a spare gear, it's at a factory in the Dark Valley. The local scout, Seroiga, Serioga, told me that he saw several in those places. So if you want to get and plant Rostock, you must first go to the valley, bring a reducer and repair an APC. I'll help you, I'll help you on this. Wait, I forgot. What's up? There's one more problem. The way to the Dark Valley is blocked by the anomaly cloud. What kind of anomaly is this? There's a huge accumulation of coal black smoke that comes straight out of the ground. It has almost no smell, does not hide, but conceals another danger. If you approach the cloud, several ball lightning will fly out of it, uh, out of it and attack you. And from a ball lightning, mate, there's no salvation. What kind of protection is not there? Um, they will not touch the costume, but the flesh underneath it, we will be burned through. Scary things. Oh, boys. So, what should I do? All roads are blocked. Well, it was walking all the time. A lot, but at some point Redis crashed. It wasn't like instantly crashing. There's a way to dispel this cloud. To do this, you need the Explorer artifact. How to get it? Good question. I saw Explorer only once in my life when I just got here. I fell into the care of an unexperienced scout named Batya. He taught me a lot. Once I witnessed how Batya scattered the cloud with the help of Explorer, which appeared in dangerous proximity to our shelter. The bottom line is that the Explorer itself is not born. It must be made up of three similar artifacts. Green, yellow and red balls. You can find these balls by accident. I myself recently saw a yellow ball lying somewhere in the vicinity of an old excavator. Then I did not pick it up, but now the case turned up. So I have to collect three balls of different colors. Yes, after that you will need to approach the cloud for very close distance and then the explorer itself will be generated from the three balls and the dangerous anomaly will gradually dissipate. Where can I find these balls? Here on a dump I remember exactly in that I saw them all separately in some places, but I do not remember which ones. You know, I'll give you advice. Go to Barty's grave and ask him uh, yourself. He often tells me the answers to difficult questions as if someone whispers. By the way, if you get the explorer you can and Celesco easily overcome the victims. Barty has done so many times. And where's the grave? A great blah 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 where the wind blows, Nostradamus. I think I just got map locations. Yeah. No, that's the BDR. I saw something else. Red. A green ball hangs on one of the trees in the hollow. Yellow in the excavator's cap. Red on the roof of large round reservoir nearby. Now we can pick this fucker up. Okay, I get it. Not again. Oh, he's getting attacked. What the fuck are you thinking of? Um, let me move. Thinking of um, my agents. This is even better. Easy, boys. Time for some crackers and something to drink. ствол мужик а то разговора не будет yeah the shotgun is really strong I agree I mean it's shit on range let's say it's shit it's still shit now it gets um, better but I think now it's already deadly 
It's so fucking good in this game. I need to remember one good place where we could climb up the silo again. So most of the time it's the memory uh, error showed while reloading the website because your shed wasn't connecting. You could still read the old shit but I don't think there was anything new appearing or just not connecting and you couldn't write. Get fucked, boy. These agents are so weak with this PKM. As soon as he dropped his weapon, it was like, nope, oh, get fucked. Not sure if this is the right anomaly, but I'm going to test it. Oh, it's the wrong anomaly. But back there should be the right anomaly. No, it's not an anomaly at all. It was this one fucking teleporter, right? Yeah. Now I remember it. I think it was hiding between these silos, right? So, if you reload my website, is the chat still connecting? Or already killed? Well, it could be killed and I can't see it. Wow. These memes... Still works, okay. Oh, I was inside of you. Why didn't you teleport me? Hey! Oh, she looks like a nice girl. Why not, Zero? Need to fix my beard? Yes, I do. First of all, it's too long. Secondly, it's out of shape. But I'm trying to grow it some longer now, so I can actually fix it. I'm like partially repairing it for weeks now, but I actually want to fix it once and for all. No. It's funny how you die if you touch the um, wall of the silo. <laughs> we found it in a dead agent on the car scrapyard. So then there's one on a hollow tree and one near an excavator. I know where one excavator is. A little bit confusing that this chest isn't working, but yeah. I don't really give yeah, a fuck at this point. Not even a flying one. But making the way down could be more difficult. MP9? 
It's called Team P in, in game. I don't know if it's, uh, if uh, Team P is the same as in MP9. But we found this. Where did we find it? Pretty much in the same location, you know, on a dead guy in a bus. What is going on here? Yeah, we're going to check this out in a moment. Looks so nice. No, it doesn't. Oh, but it's actually a secondary slot. Oh, interesting. So this might be something, but not in areas where you're actually fighting mutants. Then I always prefer my shotgun. Already put it away. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Give it back. Not again! It's actually mine. Ah, oh, no, wrong detector. Yeah, I think that's actually the definition of losing, right? Losing items. No, it's still day 14. Please let me check, what is this thing here? They are putting my artifacts inside of this vehicle. That's an interesting anomaly. Yeah, you're right. We use Chameleon. Should we equip it later? But yeah, boys. Oh, and I actually got my Octo get that uh, key today. I don't know if I told you about it. I uh, was playing I'm Bread with a friend on the weekend and then we uh, finished it and tried to play something else that's like it. But yeah, King Green actually ripped me off and my key wasn't working. But I got another key, so it's okay. Yeah, boys. Okay, thanks. That's it for today and I see you back tomorrow.